Hey guys, and welcome to Let's Play Capcom Fighting Evolution for the PlayStation 2. Now, to be honest with you, I don't have a lot of experience with this game. Um, it's it's one of the one of the games Capcom came out with towards the end of the arcade era, you know, when arcades started disappearing and people weren't going anymore. And it's not the best crossover game in the series. Uh, it takes a bunch of characters from different uh, series and sticks them all together. So you can see Street Fighter 2, Darkstalkers, Street Fighter 3, and um, a game that wasn't really released in America, but uh, Red Earth, and Street Fighter Alpha as well. So there's a bunch of different like random characters and for some reason they I don't know I, I felt like they didn't really include a lot of the popular characters maybe they're more popular in, in Japan but um, options let's set up my controller the way I like it oh wait no 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 there we go I want that to be light punch that to be kick time three. I want that to be. Oh, there we go. Uh, game option. Let's just. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Okay. Arcade mode. So, you've got different characters from different games. They're all represented in different places. Five different games representative and one character exclusive to this game uh, let's see I'm going to use Sakura and Leo I don't I haven't really played as Leo before but I'm gonna use him anyway so it's just I don't know like I said I haven't I don't have much experience with this game so let's give it a shot. Can I change characters? No? Okay. There we go. And you're done, Karen. Perfect. There we go. And I guess we choose who we're playing as next by Yeah. And I wanna try Leo out. I I don't know this one very well. He's got a big old sword though. He's not very... Okay, I don't like him very much, but... That's okay! He's really slow. Okay, come on. Here we go. Alright, there we go. Get a super move off. Yes, kill him. Whoops. Stop being so slow! There we go, get him! Don't miss! Do something! Yes! Okay, good. That was close. Okay, so, like I said, I, I don't have much to say about this game. It's your typical fighter. I think it's it's kind of damaged because um, it came out so late in the game. 
that people are already kind of moving towards the next generation of of fighting games and it just wasn't as appealing as some of the other crossover games like Marvel vs. Capcom and uh, Capcom, well at the time it was probably Capcom vs. SNK was more uh, oh gosh what happened there oh no I turned into a statue Oh boy. I think what they were doing is trying to capitalize on their previous success with crossover games, but it just, I don't know, it just doesn't feel, I don't know what I'm trying to say. It just, it just doesn't feel like as good as the other ones, you know what I mean? And it should be because it's, it's, it came out much later than those other ones did. It kind of like... It's kind of like Capcom just kind of threw this together. Because they needed something to do. You know what I mean? Oh gosh. Time is over. Oh well. Let's see if I can do better against Leo. I will say this, um, after playing this game, I am really curious about Red Earth, because again, that's not a game that was brought out over here. Oh yeah, you know what, if you could just keep bringing out Leo, that would be great. I've always had trouble fighting Anacharis for some reason, I don't even know. But obviously Leo is not much of a problem. And that's the other thing. It kind of seems like because of the way certain games are, that certain characters are just way overpowered. Whoa, 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 whoa. Missed that one. Missed both of them. Good job, Sakura. So. It feels like there's a balance issue, is what I'm trying to say, I guess. My timing is way off. Quit blocking, you jerk. Get out of here. There we go, that's better. And I don't know, the final boss... I just... Eh, I don't know. I think maybe if I just picked this game up and never played a fighting game, this game would be pretty good. But since I've played so many, and there are so many good ones out there, this one just kind of falls short for me. Anyway, oh great! Now we've got the the two major bosses from Street Fighter and uh, Dark Stalkers at the same time. Fantastic! What are you trying to tell me here, Bison? I don't know if you can tell what he's doing with his hand. He's either trying to roll some dice or something else. Oh. Get out of here! I don't like your face! There we go. Get out! Oh, you butt. How do you toss someone with your foot? I don't even know. And yes! There we go. Get out of here, Bison. So clearly I'm going to be fighting with Sakura the rest of the way, because uh, Leo kind of sucks. I'm probably going to get my butt handed to me here though. Get out of here. Dang it. That's the one I'm trying to get.
Okay, well, maybe I won't get... If you're just going to stand there, you know, I'm okay with this. There we go. You win. Nice dance move, Sakura. Perfect. Yeah, okay, you just stood there. Okay. Moving along. Versus Chun Li and Ryu. Might as well just. I don't know how long the arcade mo is, but. Might as well keep going. And then you can see Ken in the background. There's Sean, Cody, T Hawk. Whoops. Oh. Whoops. And I kind of like how they took different characters that are in multiple games and just stuck them in one specific style. Like Ryu is fighting in his Street Fighter 2 style. Chun Li is fighting in her Street Fighter 3 style. Sakura is fighting in her Street Fighter Alpha style. And I like that show of respect that Sakura has. Oh, I guess, no, Ryu's, this is Street Fighter 3 Ryu. Get out of here, Ryu. No, no, it's not. It's Street Fighter 3 Ryu. It's just using the character model from Street Fighter 3, I think. Oh, he caught me, you butt. There we go. Whoa, crap. Quit blocking. Come on, dude. Here we go. I like how there's all these different characters from other games hanging out in the background. Like, there's Ken. Oh, and he got me. I was so busy looking in the background that I totally forgot to pay attention to the fight. Don't do that, by the way. That's not a great way to, to win. Okay, I'm, I'm glad to see Chun Li, though. They did pretty good against her. Yeah, here we go. Time to pour it on. Whoa! Go! A lot of this is just getting the proper timing. If you wait a little too long, you open yourself up to an attack. If you are a little too early, you miss, and then you open yourself up to an attack. So it's just a matter of timing, getting things figuring out when to do things and when not to do things all right versus that guy in another sakura okay okay well that got said at least he's a big target Go, Sakura! You can do this! Yep, see I was a little early on that first hit, but not the second one. And I kicked off my shoe! And it hit me in the head. That takes skill. Yeah, I kind of wish I'd not picked uh, Leo here. But soccer is cool. Whoops. Okay, yeah. Also, distance. Distance is good. Make sure you're at the correct distance. I uh, see I was early on that one. And so she blocked it. 
There we go. Oh crap. And she was early on that one. So I it missed me completely. And there we go. <laughs> I like Sakura. She's funny. Alright, well let's keep going with it. Let's see what's next. Is it final boss time, please? Yes. Oh well, I guess it's Pyron from Darkstalkers. Is this the final boss? Whoops. At least we know what to expect each round. He got a hit off. Got him. Okay, good. Get out of here, Pyron. Okay. Round two. Gotcha. Whoops. Stop teleporting. Get out of here, Pyron. And I kicked off my shoe again. So yeah, pretty much is that was that it? I guess so. So that's pretty much it for Capcom Fighting Evolution. I mean, it's a it's a good game. It just it falls short of a lot of other fighting games from Capcom even. So I don't know. It might be worth checking out. But I wouldn't go out of your way to, to get it. If you're like a hardcore fighting game fan, you know, then it might be worth it to you. But if you're just looking for a fighting game for the PlayStation 2, there are much better options available to you. Um, although some of those options might be uh, a little hard to, um, to come by. Uh, I'm looking at you, Marvel vs. Capcom 2. But at least you can get Marvel vs. Capcom 2 on, like, PlayStation Network, I think. Unless they pulled it off their their listing. Because I know they did that for a few, a few things. But that's Leo's ending. I, I don't really know what's going on there, but... That's Capcom Fighting Evolution, guys. Um... Yeah, I hope you I hope you liked it. I'm just gonna skip the rest of that. Put my initials in here. Not that it's gonna matter. But I hope you enjoyed this let's demo of uh Capcom Fighting Evolution. Um like I said, you know, it could be it could be better, but it could be work and then I unlocked a new character. Okay, cool. Not that it matters because I don't have the memory card plugged in. And but that's okay. And there he is. Pyron's unlocked. I guess there's going to be another unlockable too. I, d I don't know. But anyway, this has been Capcom Fighting Evolution for the PlayStation 2. Hope you enjoyed it and I will see you for the next one.